Okay, today we've got a new version of a Silent ROM. It's based on Jelly Bean 4.2.2 and there's a, a few little differences, so let's go and have a look. Right, so the lock screen is slightly different. Um, the color is white instead of gray, and that's um, the theme throughout Jelly Bean 2.2 difference. I've actually got a video based on the difference of 4.2.2 and 4.2.1, so you can check that out. But this is another story. So as you can see, the menu is a little bit different. We have, it looks like a change in DPI, but it's not. The DPI is the same, it's just the change in size of the font. So we can see Jelly Bean 4.2.2 there. And this is the latest version of Asylum. Now I quite like the menu system here. You've got the expanded option on the right hand column. Um, the only problem with that, the left hand column is a little bit small. or You can't quite see the entire word, even though I'm pretty sure you know that when it says lock screen, it's lock screen. Okay, so we've got themes there. We have the lock screen options and we have the launcher, which comes with Nova embedded. You can change that, but you know, Nova looks quite cool. And they've actually fixed a couple of issues. When you change the screen, you can see the little corner doesn't blur at the top anymore, which is great because that really annoyed me last time. So it looks nice and smooth. And this is a really small ROM again. They had a 116 megabyte ROM last time, and it's the same, so it's, it's very, very small and very smooth. Now if we go and have a look at, say, a wallpaper, a live wallpaper, live wallpapers don't work with this ROM, so if you are a diehard fan of live wallpapers, like this one, it looks kind of cool, but if I go set as live wallpaper, it will crash or not respond. So there, yeah, we can't get live wallpapers working with this ROM. Unsure why. Anyway, so moving on. Another great feature of CM10 ROMs is the ability to use dash clock. And I really like that. It's nice and smooth, nice and clean. Okay, so a big difference, like I said in the beginning of the movie, the color of the text is white. It used to be a slight off-white, like an almost gray color. And we can see that theme throughout the whole ROM as 4.2.2. Another change with 4.2.2, let me just select a picture and show you, when you edit it, you have three more, uh, what are they called, borders. So if we go into edit now, and show you those borders, second in, okay, so those three borders. So that one is grunge, the next one is sumi, and the last one's tape. So you can see the sort of sellotape residue left over. Um, yeah, there's some nice effects. All right, taking a look at the lock screen, we can see the same theme throughout the white instead of the gray. And we have dash clock and we have the option to have the camera. Okay, so the best CM10 ROMs would be Stunner 2 and this one. It's up to you what you think is going to work best for you, but this ROM certainly is very, very smooth. So um, download it.